In this video, we will demonstrate the use of the NEOS open tray impression technique. In an open tray technique, the impression coping is picked up in the impression material. The NEOS open tray impression coping is available in 8 and 13 mm lengths and is packaged in a kit consisting of the impression coping, screw, plastic extension tube and replica. A unique feature of all NEOS impression copings is that they are self-seating. This means that the screw will not engage the implant if the coping is not correctly seated. However, a radiograph is recommended if there is any uncertainty or risk of soft tissue entrapment. Use the open tray impression coping as supplied. The implant connection is exposed and we make sure it is clear of any soft or hard tissue. Place the desired length impression coping onto the implant and tighten the screw. Hand tightening is sufficient by using the screwdriver and manual handle. We then try in the modified impression tray. A window has been previously cut in the area of the implant. And ensure that the tray is clear of the impression coping and the plastic tube extends beyond the impression tray. Using a medium to heavy body impression material, inject around the impression coping and fill the impression tray. Seat the impression tray into the patient and ensure the plastic tube is clearly visible. After the impression material has set, either grasp the plastic sleeve with tweezers and remove, or using a probe, remove the impression material from inside the plastic sleeve. Using the screwdriver, ensure that the screw has been completely undone or disengaged from the coping and remove the impression. Take care when attaching the implant replica to the impression coping.